It is in the dragonfly's other world that life goes on. There the larvae are developing. Dull in color and sporting only the buds of wings, at this stage they barely resemble their parents. These demoiselle nymphs have hatched from the eggs that were laid in early summer. They have already molted several times. At the same time, other demoiselle larvae are just hatching, protected by the plant stems where they were laid a few weeks ago. Now in August, they push their way out into the open water, tiny worm-like creatures only a few millimeters long. They will shed the first of many skins almost immediately. The newly hatched damselfly nymphs groom themselves. Then they stretch out their legs. At the tip of the abdomen are three leaf-like gills. This is a key distinguishing feature. Dragonfly nymphs have spiny internal gills. Even at this young stage, they are active predators and fiercely guard their hunting patch, using their tails as weapons. Dragonfly and damselfly nymphs alike are commonly called pond monsters. They prey on water insects, other larvae, and even tadpoles and small fish. Depending on the species, nymphs may take weeks or years to develop in this underwater world. The water plants are home to thousands of nymphs. When the time is right, they will climb up the plant stems to undergo the final 